Joomla ships with a special hidden file called HT Access, which amongst other things ensures that your website URLs do not include the words index.php. If you've already set this up before, you'll have done this on the system global configuration and set the use URL rewriting to yes, having created that special .ht access file on your web server. If this all worked fine, then you can happily proceed with the HT Access Maker part of admin tools. For this to work, you must make sure you're using Apache or any other web server compatible with HT Access files. If you are not sure, then please ask your web host. You'll find the HT Access Maker in the security section of Admin Tools Professional. Remember, if you've already been able to create without any modification in a .ht access file, then you can happily proceed with this section. However, you should note that any changes made here have the possibility of completely blocking your entire website. So before you proceed, you should make sure that you have FTP or some hosting control panel file manager access to get your site back online just in case something goes wrong. If when you use Joomla's own HT access file, you had to make some changes for it to work on your web host, you'll find those right down the bottom of this file. The most likely ones that you will have changed was to set the follow sim links to yes and the base directory of your site from slash to some subdirectory. If you were able to make Joomla's own HT access file work without any changes, you can simply leave, leave these as the defaults. Remember, defaults are there for a very good reason. And if you don't know what something is, then you should leave it alone. If we scroll back to the top, we can see that the HD access file that this HD access maker will create includes various options to enhance the basic security of your websites. Each one of these is documented in the admin tools documentation section of the akibabackup.com website. In addition to some website security, there's also some additional server protection that is provided. Some components may work in a non-standard way and you will have to provide exceptions to allow direct access to those files. Here we can see three examples for Akiba Backup, Admin Tools and the Joomla Update components. It may be that you will have to add additional exceptions for some of your components that are on your website. In addition, towards the end of this, we have the opportunity to create some custom HT access rules. If you don't know what these are, don't worry about it. It doesn't apply to you. But if you've had to create some already, then this is where you will add them. When you're happy with the settings, click on the big green Save and Create HT Access. Your new HT Access file has been written to the disk and a backup has been taken of the old one. At this point, you should check to make sure that every aspect of your website is working as it did before. It should do, but it may be necessary for some of your components to provide exceptions. If, for some reason, your website is now completely blank or you have a 500 error, you should use your control panel file manager or FTP to locate the .ht access file in the root of your web space, rename your .ht access file perhaps 
to HT Access New. This will prevent it from working and your website will reload. And you should then reload Admin Tools Professional and the HT Access Maker and review the settings until your website is working perfectly.